Hey everybody, this is Corey again. Um, today we're going to do another Primal TCG opening, uh, a phrase which I'm probably going to repeat several times. Um, last time we opened up 10 collector boosters, and uh, that video took forever, so I'm not trying to take as long this time. Oh man, my chair is creaky, sorry about that. But I'm not trying to take as long this time. Um, and so to help with that, we're going to be opening up the starter decks today. Well, one of the four starter decks, these guys, these four. Um, and we'll do one video for each of them. That way the videos are easily sortable. And also that way the videos don't run too long. So going to get right started and we'll go alphabetically, which means cane pirates are up first here. Um, so this is actually the third of these starter decks. I got four of each. Um, this is the third one I'm opening because me and my roommates wanted to play. And so, you know, figured start with some starter decks. Ooh, get that off there. Um, all right, so you get a nice little contents list on the back here. That tells you everything you're going to get. Um, but since probably none of you know what those card names relate to, I've got to show you. So the starter decks are all right. Haven't done every possible matchup, you know, the round robin between the four of them, but um, so far, looks like this and the Plagueis deck are where it's at. Oh man, these back cards are really stuck in there. Um, and I do know that the super rares are at the back, so we'll get there when it comes. You get two super rares in all these decks. Um, but randomly, the cards seem kind of inserted with no rhyme or reason. We start with the ability cards. Um, we got a Brute Strength. Actually, we've got two of those. Hungry Ambition. And I'll just briefly pause on everything if you want to if you want to pause the video and read it. Faint. A whole place set of that. And these starter decks are pretty cool. You know what? If these back cards are gonna keep popping up. <laughs> you didn't see nothing. We'll come we'll come back to them. Um But the starter decks are pretty cool. They come with quite a bit of like two ofs, three ofs, so you really only would need one to get started playing. Um, don't know how they, how good they all are in the grand scope of all the cards, but amongst the starter decks, like I was saying, the plague is over there, and these came pirates seem to be the best. Um, all right, now we're into the characters. So we've got a play set of Hari, I know that much. Ooh. And sorry, this is a little hard for me, just the way I'm set up here. Uh, to make sure that the cards are in focus, kind of tucked behind the camera a little bit. Mimi. <laughs> From having played a little bit, the um, Mimi and this guy, Small Fry, these straight vanillas are pretty terrible. Um, so I would suggest if you're able to get your hands on any of these cards, get yourself two copies of any deck you're interested in. And between those two copies of the deck, you can make it a lot better. Um, I'll probably have some deck tech videos soon enough. Um, a whole series of which might just be these starter decks, but slightly upgraded. Um, probably going to make those, because uh, that's what my roommates and I have been playing with. Hey, look, it's our profile picture. I had to. The guy's name's Chad. What else can I say? Um, this guy's actually pretty great. Um... So I'm happy, you know. Funny card, and he's powerful. Leona is also very, very powerful. Um, this guy's okay, but I think he's a little niche. Why am I randomly just now giving my opinions on cards? Um, we're gonna stop. We're strictly just showing you what you get in these decks. Um, which we're kind of coming to the end of it now. Uh... But yeah, like I was saying, a lot of play sets are at least two ofs. Like this card, you probably wouldn't run a play set, or maybe you would. <laughs> Nanami randomly at the back, zero drop. Um, this is a card you'd want many, many more of. Uh, I think she only comes in this and the Dragon starter deck. So yeah, you want more of her. Uh, get her, however. Irresistible Rapture is an insanely good card. I would put it in any deck that runs either of these elements. Um, Docked is fine, it's okay, I wouldn't say it's that good, and I, it's kind of hard to see, it's a zero there, that's nothing, no cost really. 
This card's very funny. It's okay. I think a two of's appropriate. I don't know how I feel about this card. It's kind of mid. But anyway, that was it, except for you get two Captain Kane, the namesake of the Kane Pirates. He's really, really good. Oh man, this one. This one's got some uh, sword marks on it. This guy, uh, he chopped up the art himself. Man, that one really is beat to hell. But uh, let's see if we can. Yeah, oh my gosh. Kind of adds some character to it. This one looks perfectly fine. Just a little dust. Um, but yeah, this guy's great. Fun boss monster. Really, really strong in his archetype. And man, did this video only run six minutes? No way. Well, anyhow, see y'all.